Hi, this is a quick video on how to install Slicer on Windows for Fusion 360. Uh, if you do a quick search, you'll come back to two good links. Uh, give you a quick tip uh, and, and read through it. And there is a good YouTube video at the end. But this will give you a link to the App Store. What you need to be wary of is when you go to the App Store, by default, it is uh, linked to the Mac OS download. So you have to log in and then click on Win64. Once done that you should be able to download it uh, as an exe file and then when you're inside of, of fusion 360 you go to make 3d print uh, and then come and select on custom utility and then go and search on the executable it'll actually uh, launch a, a extraction to see autodesk folder once that's downloaded and installed it will actually run and install it for you which you then need to accept the terms and conditions. So once uh, Slicer is installed you'll see it now shows up under under the make command so if you click on slice and then select your object uh, it will kick off Slicer uh, and ultimately you'll accept terms and conditions and uh, it will be installed for you.